Welcome to WebDMA demonstration video. This is an overview of location hierarchy in WebDMA. WebDMA location hierarchy can use as many as eight levels. The following list shows the default names in order of priority. Divisions, regions, district, facilities, entity, building, floors, and areas. Let's take a look on a division level. The division is an optional hierarchy level. It is the highest reporting level in the hierarchy, similar to a national or international office. Now, let's move on to the next level, which is region. The region is an optional hierarchy level. It defines a large geographical region within a division such as a group of state. An organization can have more than one region and each region can have any number of districts linked to it. Information about the linked district is also displayed at the region level. To see the linked district, click on Total View tab. Then, click on the District sub-tab. The program will list down all districts within the region. Let's move on to the next level, which is District. The optional District level defines specific geographical territories within a region such as one state. An organization can have more than one district, and each district can have any number of facilities linked to it. Information about linked facilities is also displayed at the district level. To see the linked facilities, click on Total View tab. Then, click on Facilities sub-tab. The program will list down all facility within the district. Let's move on to the next level, which is facility. The highest required level of reporting is the facility. The default name for this level can be changed to plan, campus, and etc. Costs roll up to this level from the lower levels, such as buildings, floors, and areas. An organization can have more than one facility, and each facility can have any number of buildings linked to it. Information about linked buildings is also displayed at the facilities level. To see the linked building, click on Total View tab. Then, click on Building sub-tab. The program will list down all buildings within the facility. Let's move on to the other level which is Entity. Entity records contain information and maintenance requirements for non-structural components such as parking lots, sidewalk, grounds, benches, and etc. Non-structural items are associated with facility. An entity can be used in a number of ways. It can be grouped, connected to work orders, and scheduled for plan maintenance. Let's move on to the next level, which is building. Buildings are the second required level of the location hierarchy and contain all the records of building within facility. Although this level is called building, other items can be assigned to this level. Let's click on Contractor tab. Contractors can be associated with a building so that you can view a list of affiliated maintenance contracts. 
Let's move on to the next level, which is floors. Floors are optional hierarchy level. However, floors window is used to describe separate floors within a building. Let's move on to the last level of location hierarchy, which is areas. Areas is the lowest required location level. Information about items such as equipment and assets is linked to area record. In many organizations, the area level is equivalent to the rooms within a building. For your information, location hierarchy can be summarized in three view. To see the location hierarchy in three view, click on File, then click on Total View. Expand the location view. The first level is region. Expand one of the region. The program will list down all districts within the region. Expand one of the district. Then, program will list down all facility within the district. Expand one of the facility. To see all buildings within the facility, expand building. To see all floors inside the building, expand one of the building. Then, expand floor. Within the floor, there might have areas or might not. Plus sign indicate that the floor contains area records. To see the areas on the floor, expand area. Program will list down all area types available. Expand one of the area types. Then you can see all the available areas. That is how the location hierarchy are structured in tree view. Thank you for watching.